everyone. Thanks for tuning in to 2K Sports for this NBA presentation. In this game, we'll see the Milwaukee Bucks going up against the Philadelphia 76ers. I'm Kevin Harlan, joined by the talented analyst tandem of Greg Anthony and Chris Weber. David Aldridge is on our sideline. DA, it's all yours. Kevin, thank you. Chris Middleton has been underrated for so long that now is he rated? Giannis Adentacumpo said, people don't know how much Chris has sacrificed for this team to be great. And guys, it hasn't been pretty for him in the past five games. He's having one of those scoring slumps that all players go through at some point in the season. But I know he hadn't lost his confidence, and I expect this young man to get after it here tonight. Now a look at Philadelphia's starting lineup. The stars of this team in the post, Harris and Embiid. Harden out there with Maxi, and it's Green in at the small forward. And for Milwaukee, longtime teammates Middleton and Giannis, the forwards. Holiday out there with Allen, and it's Portis in at center. And Greg people already predicting the MVP for this season. Is it too early to start talking about? I mean, we have roughly half a season left to play. Y yet people love to talk about sports, period, especially when it comes to the most prestigious individual award out there. And so it's the 76ers getting on the board first. Holiday gets the bucket. A really smart player. Holiday can find the spaces inside and exploit them for points. Now here's MB. Now here is Harden. Count that one. Yeah. Kumbo against Harris. Fouled on the shot and picks up two points, so one free throw coming up. Just simply overpowers the defense. Giannis flexing the muscles he's added to that near seven-foot frame. Milwaukee shooting their first free throw attempt on the night. George Niang, he's checked in for Harris. Second team foul. At the line for the box, Giannis Antetokounmpo. One shot. In 2020, worth over 200 million. And their post play has been really solid right off the bat. The Bucs have gotten four of six field goal attempts to drop in the first quarter. Holiday attacking, and he drops in the way up off the glass. And how about the burst there of speed from Holiday on the drive, zipping in before the D can rotate. And really an incredible playmaker his entire career. The Harden has taken that up a notch. And he now often looks for his teammates first. Milwaukee in the lead. Holiday, the pass to Antetokounmpo. And Embiid with the block. Awesome timing on the reception. Embiid, the big fella. You don't want to break up. You're right. He take that 10 out of 10 times. You're not going to miss many of those. Here's Harden. Good, and it's Green picking up the assist. And it's eight points for James Harden. Man, he's having quite the quarter, converting at a really high percentage. Now here is Holiday. Tight defense on him. Here's Middleton. And again, it's Milwaukee converting. Eight points in the quarter and has that terrific basketball instinct on display. Back to the action after this word. And as we know, the great ones make those around them better. That's certainly the case with Giannis Antetokounmpo. I'm a lot more comfortable. Uh, it's because my teammates trust me. My team trusts me to make that I play. And Giannis dishes to Allen. The kick out to Holiday. Nice ball movement by Milwaukee. 
Antetokounmpo passes to Allen. Embiid against Allen. Aston Yang takes a three. Bucket number three. He's a perfect three for three to start. And they may be leaning a little too heavily on the three-pointer when, when there are better looks to be had inside. Here's Yacht and the slam dunk by Antetokounmpo. And we talk about Antetokounmpo's all-around skills, and tonight it's been about... It's stolen by Milton. Here's Maxi, And that one off the back of the rim and in. maxie has got his first points of the game. Textbook. Nice pass. Great catch. Even better finish. Giannis passes to Portis. Back to Giannis. The top of the key jumper is on the mark. Giannis has got eight points here in this quarter. And this is an area where Giannis wants to improve. I think the key for him to continue to grow is to shoot those with confidence. Yep, that one goes. That's there. Outside, out of the Kumbo. Allen for three. And no luck with that time on the buzzer beater. And that'll do it for the first half. A competitive game so far. Bucks ahead, up by four. And a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge, standing by courtside. David. Thanks, guys. Here with Coach Budenholzer. Mike, your evaluation of the first half. Well, I think both teams' this defense is pretty good. You know, hopefully somebody can catch a rhythm here and score some points. Um, you know, hopefully we can be better there. And that'll be key as the game goes on, Coach. Thanks. Back to you. All right, thank you, David. And folks, don't go away. After the break, we'll see you right back here for the start of quarter number three. Action already in this one. I'm Ernie Johnson, along with Kenny the Jet Smith and Shaquille O'Neal. A tremendous game we're seeing from Giannis Antetokounmpo. He ended up with 15 points, five block shots, and four assists. And Kenny, what did you think about what we saw from Milwaukee? They found a slight edge on the boards. And they've done it with nothing but raw determination. I mean, look, they've got talent, but the passion is there. And that separates these guys. They're simply refusing to give up possession. And over to Shaq, what did you think about Philadelphia? Can't believe the coach hasn't been screaming for better looks. They've been letting it fly from the Chiefs season for almost nothing to show for. Thanks for joining us, folks. We're now just a few minutes away from the start of the third quarter. And after a fairly even first couple of quarters, the second half could turn out to be a great one as both teams try to gain an edge. Joel Embiid has been sensational. As impressive as the block totals are from him early on, they don't even tell the whole story. He's changed countless others. The blocks are impressive, no doubt. But his intimidation factor actually prevents certain shots from ever being taken at all. Here is Harden. Ten points for him. Embiid, the pass to Joe. Back to Embiid. Good on the three-point shot. Embiid. Embiid's got the lead up to two now for the 76ers. Now, it's never been more important for Biggs to be able to stretch the floor, and Embiid has no problem doing so. Embiid against Middleton. And Philadelphia grabs the miss. You're not going to see that very often. Plenty of space, but he just, let's face it, he puts on it. And slam dunk by Harris. Everybody on that bench. And, and rightfully so. Also, how lackluster was the defense right there with the score this tight? Now here's Young. He's got 18, and it's in there. And I can't think of a higher percentage look than that. Now Giannis, one of the best ever working inside. Here's Joe, defended by Allen. That's to Joe. This one for three. It's good. The assist that time from Harden. Harden's got five assists in the game. Here's Giannis. 20 points for him. Plays it up and banks it in. Giannis Sixers. Scoring, rebounding. He was all over the place during that quarter. 
They are writing his performance right now. And don't go away. We'll be right back. And how about a look now at our assist of the game? Brought to you by State Farm. Yeah, an easy choice tonight. Look at the precision on this pass. Put it on a platter for him. Yeah, he put it on the platter, and it was served cold. Now, I love the poise, the decisive. High post, MB working on Portis. Embiid inside, defended by Portis. Embiid's shot is good. Embiid's got 13 points here in the second half alone. Here's Holiday. It's hauled in by Harris. Harris has got his fourth rebound in this one. Here's Embiid. A chance to extend the lead to double digits, but it's no good. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. He just punched the ticket on that one. That'll get the job done. Powerful two and jam. To the paint. Middleton dishes to Giannis. And they double up Giannis. Five on the clock. Middleton the pass to Antetokounmpo. Milwaukee needs to get off a shot here. That's good, and the 76ers' lead is cut to just five points in the basket for Middleton. Logs his first three of the second half. After nearly two in the first, they don't want to let this fella get going. Harris outside. And they come right back with their own three-pointer. And the 76ers lead by eight. Here's Holiday driving in, and he banks in the lane. Holiday. And it's Harden with the ball for the 76ers. High post, MB working on Portis. And there's the pass to Harden. Over to the wing. Here's Maxi. Another three for Philadelphia. Oh, you got to admire the passing skills of Hart. He's really upped his playmaking totals over the years. Pass to Matthews. Giannis with it. And onto Takumbo. Shoots it in. He's been as dependable as he always is. He can't do it all by himself. And now a moment to present the New Balance Player of the Game, Joel Embiid. And guys, no doubt who our pick was going to be. Uh, he's made everyone else on the court look like they're playing at half speed. It's been total domination, and you can't help but just sit back and admire that performance. Milwaukee making a switch here. Portis has checked in. And the 76ers lead by four. And when Harden sees a clear lane to the hoop, just move out the way. He jumps on it. So relentless in how he exploits open space. Onto Takumbo, passes to Middleton, and it's good. Two points. Middleton's got seven points for the quarter. And how about the grit and determination in the post? I mean, essential qualities to have late in a close game. Harris outside. And it's off from three-point range. It's been a really tough quarter for him. I mean, he cannot get his shots to drop. The shot by Middleton, wide open. Good, and the assist goes to Giannis. Giannis has got assist number eight here in this one already. And half, the 76ers trail. Harden outside, driving to the basket. Here's Embiid. The bucket is good. He'll have a chance for one more. It goes on Chris Middleton. He's kept the integrity of their offense tonight by moving and cutting and scoring every time they've needed him. Joel Embiid at the line for one. Here's Harris, and the rejection by Ibaka. On the wing, Holiday, guarded by Hart. And Holiday gives to Giannis. 
It's Allen on the way. Middleton trying to break three. That's good from Allen on the assist by Giannis. Giannis has got assist number nine. Wow, what an effort here tonight. Pass to Embiid. Fade away. And misses it off the right side of the rim. Here's on to Takumbo. Good work there as it goes. And it's a three-point Bucks lead. Here's Maxi, guarded by Holiday. Over to the left wing. Got it! A tremendous three to tie it up. Oh, you just love seeing a player with absolutely no fear. Yeah, he approached that one with total confidence. He has what it takes to come through in the clutch. And the double up out of the Kumbo. Takes it down to Middleton. And the pressure just doesn't get to Middleton. In fact, he enjoys, embraces it, loves the opportunity to take the big shot. There's 38 seconds left in the fourth quarter. That one is good from Joel Embiid. He wants the ball. They want him to have the ball. And as usual, he comes through in the clutch. Middleton on the wing. Three-pointer. Places one from three. And this is why he gets paid the big bucks. Middleton enjoys coming through in the clutch. Timeout called the 76. A fantastic ball game, and they did a great job making sure it didn't get away from them late. Yeah, I mean, they faced some challenges, but really held firm when they needed to. On both ends, just effective in terms of coming away with this win. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Thanks very much, Chris. Do you see Giannis every day? Seems to still come up big every time. He's showing how great he is. I mean, he's been consistent all year. He's been a threat in the paint. And he's been a great leader, too. So, I mean, he's having a, a heck of a year. And we need him to be that player, that great player for us. He's certainly performing at that level. Congrats on the win. Back to you. All right, David, thank you. And tonight, folks, for our broadcast, for Chris Weber, Greg Anthony, and David Alders, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. We'll see you later.